Hi, Randy Pearson, Vice President of Life and Annuities here at Gore Marketing, speaking to you from our fantastic studios. And today I've got Paul Bechtel, our manager of our debt elimination strategies. And today we wanted to talk to you about two great modern financial gurus. And so Paul, for the edification of our audience, who might those two financial gurus be? Well, Randy, the first one we're gonna talk about is uh, Robert Kiyosaki wrote the book, uh, Rich Dad, Poor Dad. Most people are familiar with him. Uh, the second one, maybe not so much, uh, would be R. Nelson Nash. He wrote the, the book, Becoming Your Own Banker. And so in, in terms of what I do, sh helping agents to help their clients understand the leverage of dividend paying whole life insurance, or even possibly a properly structured high cash value index universal life policy, and how to leverage it for both delimination and wealth generation. Um, both guys are, are um, you know, becoming household names. De definitely much more so with Robert Kiyosaki. Um, most people are more uh, familiar with the book Rich Dad, Poor Dad. But there is a movement afoot of Nelson Nash and the Becoming Your Own Banker uh, okay. theory with, with infinite banking as well. All right. So let's dive into that a little bit deeper. I mean, what, why in today's environment um, does the message that each of those financial gurus uh, deliver so salient in, in, in our market now? Well, obviously over time, there's been many different financial uh, strategies, theories, ways to save for retirement, whatever the case may be. And, uh, you know, as I like to say, and, and you would embrace probably, is money always goes where it's treated best, right? Mm -hmm. And people starting to see the, the failings of the 401k, for example, you know, the fact that with rising tax rates, uh, inflation, market risk and volatility, things like that, that there might be better places to put put your money, right? And mm -hmm. so I'll talk about first about, you know, Kiyosaki and the rich dad, poor dad. So he, he basically has three foundational fundamentals that he kind of emphasizes to clients. One is pay yourself first, right. okay? Second is buy assets, not liabilities. Okay, mm -hmm. and, and a dividend paying whole life insurance policy or an IUL, that's accumulating cash value as, as an appreciating and accumulating asset, right? Mm -hmm. The last part is it's not what you make, but what you keep that matters, okay? True that. So at the end of the day, we have less uh, dripping through the funnel mm -hmm. in, in, in that instance, uh, you know, with what Robert Kiyosaki's teaching. Similarly, with Nelson Nash, obviously, extolling the virtues of dividend paying whole life insurance for both long-term wealth accumulation and debt elimination, becoming your own banker, we employ some of the same principles, all right? Mm -hmm. Albeit a little bit lesser known with Nat Nash than Kiyosaki. Yeah, it's interesting, especially with Kiyosaki, the, the pay yourself first mantra. You know, I've been in the business 35 years and way back when I was a 20 something in the business, I used to preach that message. And the thing that I always found true was that uh, it didn't matter whether you were talking to somebody who's making $35,000 a year or $350,000 a year or more. Most consumers, most people in America tend to spend every penny they make, right? right. And that simple principle, pay yourself first, put some money aside for yourself, your family, your future, is key. Now, whether that be in a, a life insurance policy, we think would certainly be an advisable home for that. Um, but it's not just putting in a life insurance policy. It needs to be placed in a well-constructed, properly formulated life insurance. Wouldn't, wouldn't you agree? A absolutely, yes. And, uh, um, you know, just getting down to basic, symbol fundamentals of putting your money where it's treated best, paying the least amount of taxes, you know, common denominators like that, wh where everybody would agree, yeah, I want that. That, that means more money in my pocket, and that yeah. means I get to keep more. And um, also putting in a place, for, for example, when we're becoming our own banker, where we can use the money and it can still earn us interest at the same time, uh, phenomenal concepts. The last point I'd like to make, Randy, is this, is anytime we talk to people it, nowadays in modern times is what's the first thing that they want to do when you present them a new concept maybe maybe research it a yeah bit, sure right so by offering those names out by offering a guy's name like robert kiyosaki who they probably already heard of before or nelson nash and they go do a little 
research, it only reinforces the principles that you're trying to instill into them, right? I couldn't agree more. Yeah, you know, and, and uh, principles that every advisor out there could implement, right? And you don't have to be, you don't have to study for a lengthy period of time, become a PhD in some of these concepts, particularly say infinite banking, to be able to communicate some of these strategies that can literally be life-changing for the average consumer out there in America, right? I mean, once again, I know you preach it all the time, but I mean, what are the statistics? 85, 90% of Americans are in debt up to their eyeballs. Mm -hmm. And if we can just help them solve that key financial problem, it can change their life forever. Right? Correct. You know, well, you know, case in point, the last four going on five years, again, probably this year, our top life insurance salesperson will be somebody that's going out and having these very conversations you know, with clients. You know, that's a really excellent point. Uh, you know, true, true, true that statement. Our number one guy has consistently over the last several years been somebody operating and using that mantra as a way to get in front of people, open doors. But today we have several of our top producers are utilizing that strategy. And so I would encourage you as an advisor, if you're watching this video and you're thinking, or, or you think on a regular basis, how can I get in front of more prospects on a favorable basis? I would encourage you to reach out to Paul. Have a conversation about this subject matter and this arena and how you might be able to incorporate that into your practice. And now is a great time to chat with Paul because we've got some new and exciting um, uh, enhancements to this area that I'm sure Paul would love to tell you about and you might want to get involved in that. As I, I used the word a couple of moments ago, transformative. Some of the things that we're coming out with will be transformative to producers, practices, um, agents, sales that choose to learn about what we have to offer. Wouldn't you agree? Absolutely. Um, and you don't have to be an expert in, in the subject area. You just have to know the question to ask your client to get them to offer a little bit of financial information, bring it to us, and we'll help put it together for you. And by the way, We've been closing some fantastic cases of late. Have you noticed, Randy? I couldn't agree more. In fact, uh, I heard about a, a six-figure case that we just closed yesterday. We got a $500,000 premium case last week through the door. And listen, I mean, if you want to be a part of it, you got to pick up the phone and give us a call here at Gord Marketing or reach out to Paul. Uh, Paul, give them your contact information before we close this video out. Sure. You can reach me at paul at gordonmarketing.com or you can call my cell. Uh, 24-7 pretty much, 317-626-3054. Uh, I'll be glad to take a call and talk to you about how we can put you and your client in a much better position. Absolutely. Hey, before we say goodbye, I do want to ask that uh, if you could do me a favor and click subscribe at the bottom of this video as well as the notification bell so that every time we come out with some new content that'll have a positive impact on your practice, you'll be sure to hear about it. But for now, on behalf of Paul and myself, happy selling.